going. Get Adam from the airport. Let's go. So, what are you doing here? Why are you here? Uh, There's multiple ways you can take that question. Yeah, what, what the hell am I doing here, man? Well, I'm here for eight days. Uh, so my my family and I are moving uh, in a month to Seattle from Toronto. Yes. So this trip is well. There's a lot going on, really. There's uh, finding a house to live in. That's you know kind of important. So we don't live out of boxes. That'd be weird. Yes. Um, got to set up a bank, social insurance number, social insurance number, social security number. Oh yeah. That's what it's called. That's yeah. what it's called here. Yeah, you yanks. Yeah, okay, that's right. Um, and then, uh, uh, what else am I doing? Um, I gotta do a driver's test. Nice. Or the written test, because I can't do the, dri the driven one yet. It's crazy, I've been driving since I was 19. I'm 34, by the way. And uh, I've gotta do my test all over again, even though I've got a full license right now. I could, rent a, I could rent a car, definitely. It's pretty pretty amazing. <laughs> um, meet, we have, you know, Sam. Who, who's new in the team? Sam, uh, Elijah. I think those are the two new teammates we have yes so I'm gonna obviously meet them in person we've only been talking through a webcam yeah, okay all, all right just yeah just just stop right there no problem yeah all good yeah you didn't need to like drive in here did you no no totally I didn't I wanted to just actually park <laughs> on the sidewalk in front of all these people <laughs> Guys, what's, going, what's going on over here? So I think we may know why we have uh, some of these uh, options menu crashes. Um, I mean, we're looking at the, one of the logs right here. I don't know if you can zoom in, but... Basically what's happening is the game is starting up, we go into the options menu, and then we trigger this. Right. And if you notice that the resolution that it's trying to allocate is massive, is massive. And as soon as that happens, uh, the GPU tries to allocate it, and that's when we start getting these timeout on the GPUs. Got it. Um, uh, just to be clear here, that says 15360. That's like... That's right. That's 15,000 that, by 8,000 something. Like that. that is like 8K. Uh, that might be higher than 8K. You're right. Yeah, that, that's massive. The, so, so, no, no GPU will succeed at that. So <laughs> your game just starts at your regular resolution because like... Yeah, and then as soon as you go to the settings menu, it's right. like... Oh wait, we have to render this out at this ridiculous size. It is surprising that this just started showing up. Um, we haven't really messed with that side of the code in quite some time. Right. Um, but we have tracked it down, what's causing it. So, so hooray! Uh, that's, that's half the battle. Once we know what's, what's wrong, uh, it's easy to start figuring out how to fix it. So we should start telling people now that we support 16K uh, resolution. No, 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 I don't think so. <laughs> should we put not that, yet, not should yet. Should we put that on the box, not, 16K? Not, not yet, not yet. Um, well, we, we, we can do 4K, so we confirm that. Yeah, um, clearly. I, I know we can do 4K, but not, not quite 16K. You got, a little, you got a little excited last time you were thinking about 4K, and you were like, you know what? Yeah. Let's do 50k. Uh, yeah. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I think we're good. <laughs> Hold on, let me spin this around and just... And just... Really guys? Really? Really? That's what we're doing? What are, you, what are you doing in here? I'm talking to the camera. Well, obviously, what are you doing? I'm talking to the camera about, uh, about, uh, the stand-up. Uh, the all, all hands. Right, all right, fine. And all hands. I mean, do you want to talk about the all hands? Do you want to just jump in here with me? No. Are you sure? I need it? all my hands out here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Bye. God. All right. Um, I don't have a lot of battery left, so I have to make this quick. Okay, so Adam's here. Um, he's here for the week, he's, as, as you already heard. So we figured, all right, while he's here, let's do as much as we can with him, with the team, because he hasn't really interacted with us, been with us here in the office. Before any of this happened, we had DevGam this week. DevGam is like an independent uh, game conference for developers and industry personnel. There's a couple of them all over the world. Uh, there's also one 
that was last week here in Seattle. And Riley gave a talk about the marketing of Ashineer. I'll put a link in the description below if you want to watch that. It's actually pretty interesting. It talks about what uh, the original four or five members of the team did in order to make Ashineer successful and, and the things that they did and the things they tried and things that worked and the things that didn't work. So if you're interested in, in hearing about that, link below. You can watch the whole talk as well as all the other talks in the day if you just want to learn about independent games. The biggest thing that we did this week was the all hands. And uh, we call it the all hands. It's essentially a meeting where all everyone from the team all gets together and uh, we do status updates about status of the company. We talk about culture stuff. We talk about uh, where we're going in the future. Um, and we also, everyone shows off and talks about what they do and, and where they're at. some amazing stuff I can't say anything I'm, I was told I'm not allowed to say anything yet but uh, we had updates in the uh, modularity front which like includes vehicles and bases there was some amazing stuff showed off as far as like interacting with items and seeing and the, the the UI that pops up when you examine things oh and then research so I can't say I can't give you any details but research uh, is being worked on like we've been saying uh, and we finally got to see a status update on that and it's awesome. So a lot of progress updates on what's happening with the game, um, as well as just like us all getting together in a room and talking about the future of the company, where we're going, um, and just exciting stuff, generally exciting stuff. Oh, and then on Sunday we had, since Adam was here, we decided to have like a team picnic. <laughs> great time super fun I will update you soon with what is coming from the updates from the team members specifically on what projects are working on um, if you missed last week we did talk about some new gameplay mechanics that are coming to the game very soon I can't say exactly when but uh, we'll have an experimental test so you can try out terrain as a resource really soon if you missed that video link below you can watch it I'm looking forward to next week so we can start actually showing you guys uh, some of the progress in the major boulder areas and also just like get letting you get your hands on experimental. So, okay, cool. We had a good candid moment, Joe. Nope. We got it. <laughs>